Oh, it's mine from Custom Cruises. Beautiful bit of kit. Here's my PC800 under. Okay, it's set up for rallying. Got bags of hooks and stuff to stick your tents, your sleeping bags on, racks, you know, bungees or cargo nets in this case. Jivy rack really welded up because it kept snapping. Okay, so it's completely welded solid with steel. Um, you can see here, dogs attack the bike. <laughs> dog bites down there, dog bites on the back where the dog's chewed all the underneath when I got it. Apart from that, it's an amazing bike. Okay, very low mileage for one of these things. Got some in 90,000 on. Powder coated the wheels, rebuilt pretty well everything on it. Okay, cracking bit of kit, very cool bike, amazing to ride if you've ever ridden one of these things. There's really nothing else quite does the job. Okay, but uh, don't half go as well. You know, if you ask Nick, he's quite surprised on his bandit how fast thing, this thing pulls off with the torque it's got. It's only about 50, 60 horsepower, but it's got masses of torque, which the V-Twins do, as you know. Okay, cracking bike, all the rears fold out. Okay, like that. This thing wants pushing back in and up, like that. But you can see the footrests, even them are aerodynamic. Got the electric fan switch, if I wanna turn it on here. When the ignition's on, that will work. Heated grips. Okay, do love the heated grips. This is a thing I made so I can have me sat-nav. Okay, just basically drill the master cylinder, put a one-inch bar on because it's a one-inch clamp, and away you go. Okay, saves you buying some crazy money one. Old Jivvy top box, various racks, obviously for camping, you know, all the gear. Horrible things that I need to take off. You know, pretty shitty looking things that the previous guy put on Corbin seat very comfy we'll take a, a pillion backrest here if you don't want the top box on which keeps the weight down but i do love the top box obviously fill the thing up here release the rear here if i release this so I'm pull this okay we've got a full box you can see the amount of room these things have there is no other bike on the planet you can put this much stuff in it's bigger than a gold wing and you've also got up to there so you're not just looking at level with this you're obviously coming up to here okay so you've got an enormous amount of room to get the rear wheel out piece of cake all you're gonna do unbolt unbolt backlight comes out disconnect the electrics take the spindle out because you don't even have to take the exhaust off undo the split pin undo the torque arm and the whole wheel being a drum brake will come out absolute piece of cake really is an amazing bike to work on the wheels all powder coated as you can see here i've done all the wheels just give it a damn good polish first time in god knows how long literally i hardly ever clean my bikes i'd much rather be on them but uh, the bar is beautiful and big okay again this this is powder coated you know very easy to keep clean beats the harley any day but the harley's more fun to ride <laughs> unless you get the real twisties then this thing's amazing because the fuel's under the seat okay so if we put this back down got the fuel stabilizer on there which is not honestly you should all be using because the fuel's that shitty nowadays but these things are really good came from bike it different uh, bits sticking out and you've obviously got this as well pillion backrest does go in there if you want to take the box off like i said but uh, amazing bikes absolutely unbelievable put the led bulbs in so you can see Put the lights on you can really see it the blue okay so we've got like blue illuminations there very bright very cool okay on the back obviously lights up like that and you've got your stop tails as well can get a light for the rear as well avon cobras i believe no dunlops on this because the tires are quite hard to get for these things okay avon road riders do fit as do the k555s hid bulb in the front which gives you a lot of light okay it's like a pure white light which goes for a long way you can see it right over there okay whereas the normal lights are crap i'll be honest with you so if you want a good bulb fit in hid a piece of cake to keep clean literally the things like tupperware as they call it in uh, holland and uh, just an amazing thing to ride really is if you're interested in one of these great bikes i've got five of them i might be selling some give us a call 01773 835 customcruisers.com or the new site customcruisers.eu if it ever gets done by the goddamn french thank you